In this video, we're going to go over how to make include files. Um, include files can be anything like an appearance page, a caption page, um, a parenthetical, a sworn statement, anything that you use on a regular basis that you can have preset as a template and just include it into the document. So here's how to make include files. First thing you're going to do is go into the editor. So we're going to click here on the editor button. And in this window we're going to click new because it's going to be a new file for us. When you do that you have to pick a layout. So I'm going to pick universal layout v1. And so now here you are at a blank slate. This is where you can format however you want your include to look like. So in this include, this is a sworn statement. So whatever you would put in your sworn statement, you would want uh, formatted and typed out on this page. Now that I've typed it all in, you'll see I have stop scans so that after I've included it, I can hit my F7 and it will stop here and allow me to type in the city, the day, I hit F7 again, it goes to the next one, date, hit the scan F7 again and go to the next one. You can fill all these out. Now for this, what I've done is I've typed it in and it's left justified as I type in and then I just hit my center key to center it. And this whole thing is centered from here down to examination. And then I just left that there as a uh, starting the testimony. So that's how you can do uh, an include very quickly. Uh, just taking, uh, deciding what you want to say, how you want it formatted, and getting it done. There are other things in Winner that are um, default files like Cover V2. We'll look at that for a second. And here's a cover page. And this is for a workers' compensation. You can see that they've created a caption area here using the caption box formatting. Uh, there's another video going on how just to use the caption box, so you can uh, visit that later. And then again, you'll see there are scan stops here. When you hit F7, it'll stop. You can type things in. So there's all sorts of uh, includes that you can create. And this one is a cert page. And you just you can fill this out any way you want whatever wording that needs to be in there, make sure that you got that in there correctly. You can spell check it, make sure everything is out, is in there correctly. And there you go. And that is creating include files. Thank you, and I'll see you in my next video.